Through your selfless actions, you have earned the respect of my people. They have granted you this foothold, confident that you will lead the Alliance to victory. Commander. So, we have our garrison. There's a little encampment out here where there's a couple of people just hanging about and doing stuff. Let's go and take a look, shall we? We've got some woodcutters and a pro provisioner. Let's um, let's sell some of this junk that we've got here. Okay, so we set up and repair, so that's good. There's a flight point. Dungar Long Drink, who is our flight master, or Griffin master, I should say. We've got a scout Valdez there, and so yeah, this is our little uh, little garrison. This is our little plot of land, our home from home. Barros. Orders, Commander. The garrison is really starting to take shape. We've got a lot of work to do. We've got our garrison hearthstone, so we can uh, hearth back to the. I'm gonna just put that on my uh, on my toolbar. There we go. Action bars done. Okay. Keeping it together. So much work to do. I don't even know where to start. Making sure this garrison is operational is not an easy task. Shelley ha still hasn't reported back to me. My assistant Brightstone and her crew are who knows where. Ugh. I'm so caught up, I haven't even had time to check out cash for resources. If I were a mage, do you think I could use mirror images to do all of this at once? I, that's a very good question, Barros. I don't know. Maybe you could. Okay, so we need to speak with Shelley, find Assistant Brightstone, and check the garrison cash. Let's we'll accept that. And then uh, we have a quest called Ship Salvage. Commander, we are running low on supplies. Maybe we can salvage materials from that ship we arrived on. At the rate folks are coming through the portal, we are going to be out of everything by sundown. Or moondown? I'm still getting used to this place. Okay, so we have to collect 15 uh, crates of drudge boat salvage as well. And that will give us a whole bunch of garrison resources. Maybe those orcs have something on that boat we can use. <laughs> Besides tooth-piercing devices. Okay. Uh... Vindicate to Marad. We are getting strange reports of an orc attack on a nearby Draenei settlement called Eventide Landing. I'm hearing these particular orcs are unlike any we have encountered before. They seem sickly and are pale in color. The locals could use our help, Commander. This seems like the perfect opportunity to test our garrison's capabilities. Okay, so we have to kill Nor Bloodseeker and eight pale devourers. Be careful, Commander. I These will. These orcs are real. Who knows what powers they possess? The power to die. Uh, here's Assistant Brightstone. Barros is looking for me. I've been right here with my crew the whole time. Poor guy is so busy, he's losing it. All right, break time is over. Time to get back to work. Watch your back. You wash your back. Why do dwarves always tell me to wash my back? Yep, and you get back to her. Okay, we got 50 resources from our garrison cash. Who's over here? Ken log in. Some other people. Cool. And uh, who else we need to see? Oh yeah, we need to see somebody outside. Okie dokie then. Here they are. Shelly Hamby. Need help? Where did Pippas go? Little guy keeps stealing my supplies. Oops, I meant to check in with Barros. We have just been really busy. This forest is almost out of wood. I what? This this huge trees everywhere. What are you talking about? I need to get a logging operation together. I'll send a full report to Barros as soon as possible. Farewell. Okay, so there we go. Uh, let's go hand that in while we're here. There you go, Barros. 
My men are standing ready. Can we speak a little later, sir? I don't really have time to talk at the moment. Yeah, whatever. You did what? You're a lifesaver, Commander. With those tasks out of my... Out of the way, my job will be much easier. We've got a lot of work to do. Cool. That's another 55 garrison so resources. Maybe I can actually do some stargazing tonight. That would be a nice change of pace. What? Well, yeah, I mean, you can, because... Holy crap, there's lots. Uh... Yeah, there's a lot of stars, so you can gaze all you want. Uh... <laughs> Because there is a lot of stars out there. Alright, so we need to go and kill a bunch of stuff and collect some salvage. So, off we go. Discovered the Cursed Woods. Uh, so this character has a couple of uh, crafting type uh, professions. He has enchanting and jewel crafting, which is a bit of an odd mix, but it's... It served its purpose in the past, so uh, that's what he has. We are heading over to this place. That looks like the big guy that we need to kill over there. It looks like someone's already doing him in. Okay, let's kill this pale devourer. Oh, they carry some as well, so that's, that's useful. That's good to know. Oh, can I get there before? Yeah, I got there before you. Sorry, Greenlee. Ah. Oh. A fantastic fish. What? Oh, what happened here? Oh, he died. You're not actually doing anything. But as you can see, this one has a purple glow again. Oh. Has this purple outline, which means it's a treasure of some description. And we get some more resources. Which is pretty nice. I do like where garrison resources. Whoa, where did you come from? I don't know where you come from, but I know where you're going. You're going down. That's where you're going. Okay, let's take this guy out. He's a big fella. He's a really big fella. Ouch. Actually, no, that didn't actually hurt at all, did it? Who said that? Someone under the... What? What happened? <laughs> okay, that's a bit weird. Um, are there any... No, there aren't any resources around here, are there? I can see. Oh, you've frozen me in place. Congrats. Also, you can uh, find rares by lo just looking at your minimap and seeing a big skull. Uh, Bahama Eye, I think it's called. Oh, look, there's some more treasure in here. Uh, provided I can get past all these um, pale devourers. I only need one more for the quest, but if I want to get that loot, I have to kill a few more. Finally, who is this? Oh, it's a stowaway. Stolen treasure. Excellent, we've got some more garrison resources, some more XP. We can get out of it now. Let's go kill Bahama Eye. Because that might give us something fancy too. Oh, go away. Two of you. Why aren't you dead yet? Oh, for God's sake! There's so many of them! Where do they keep coming from? Uh, no. That's not... Unfortunately, I get water walk in with my ghost form. Ghost wolf form. There it is. There he is. Okay. Let's go and take this one out.
You're going down, Bahama Eye. Is that supposed to hurt? Because it doesn't. Okay, maybe it does a little bit. Sweet, we got some fire ammonite. What's that? Oh, it's a fish. Fish. Uh, and we got some uh, garrison resources. That's oh so precious garrison resources. Cool. Now, if I remember rightly, there is uh, some sunken treasure. Yes. Let's see if we uh, go and pick that up and see if there's anything fancy in it. Probably not, but you never know. Might be something good. It's always worth keeping an eye out and exploring a little bit, just in case. Uh, just in case you miss something, because sometimes. Uh, oh, oh dear. Well, sorry, buddy. There we go, another 20,000 XP. And some more garrison resources. Is that a. Oh, it's just a chair. I thought that was some treasure as well. <laughs> That's the only problem. Chairs that look like treasure. I suppose a chair is a treasure after you've had a long day. Uh, or something. <laughs> a nice comfy chair to have a little bit of a sit down. After a, a long day slaying pale orcs. That is a treasure. Oh, that's horrible looking. Well, I say horrible looking. It's kind of horrible looking, but it's kind of cool looking at the same time. Cursed wolf. It's all green and stuff. Technically not even a beast. It's an aberration. So, let's steer clear of him. What are you doing, Lumberjack? You're not actually doing anything. Go and do some work. I'm not paying you to... Actually, no, I'm not paying you at all, am I? Well, I'm not paying you, so uh, at least pretend that you're doing some work. Oh, that woman's gone. Don't need to speak to her anyway. Alright, we have returned, everyone. It's alright. You can uh, you can breathe a sigh of relief. We're, all, we're, we're home now. Hello, Commander. Okay. Well, with all these supplies, we should be back on track. We are blessed to have you protecting us, Commander. So that's another 60 we'll garrison that. resources. Lovely jubbly. Ugh, some what? of these supplies are really waterlogged and sticky. These will get the job done, but truly, this is disgusting. <laughs> wow, okay. Don't need to be so grateful. Uh, right, Marad. This is unnerving to say the least. Those things must have come from underground. Hopefully we will have seen the last of them. I wouldn't count on it. And some more garrison resources from now. Orcs sound dangerous. Hopefully, this is the last we see of them. Okay, and then back to Barros again. Oh, let's not do that. Let's do that. Orders, Commander. I must say, Commander, this garrison has really come along. We have enough materials. All we need now are the blueprints I drafted up, and I can begin construction on your barracks. Hmm. Now, where did I put those blueprints? Find the blueprints, learn the blueprints, and use the architect table to build your barracks. I'll call in a few favors. You do that. Um, oh, they're over here. Do I really want someone that's that forgetful that he's just... I mean, he, he's... He could, he could probably almost see them from over here. I mean, it's not like I've been gone for very long. Okay, so we've uh, found some blueprints for the barracks for level one. So we'll right click on them to learn them. And now we learn them. And then we've got the architect table here, so I'll click on that. Uh, this will give you a little tutorial, I guess. If I just hover over these and you can see what they say. So, uh, we've got buildings that we've got the blueprints for, for on the left hand side here. They come in large, medium and small sizes for the various different plots that you have in the garrison. Um, we've got 301 garrison resources. 
So all our collections of resources has come down the bottom here, and uh, things will cost resources depending on uh, what it is that you're doing. Uh, this is the basic map. So here we've got the town hall, which is a tiny little shack to my left. Uh, and it's not much of a hall, uh, really. And this isn't much of a town, so, but whatever. And then uh, this is the building, and it tells you how much, what level it is, how much it costs, blah, 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 blah. Okay, so we, we'll close that. So we want to get the barracks. Let's put it in the large empty plot. And there we go. And for because this is tutorial, the, the barracks gets completed straight away. Normally, it would take about an hour uh, in game time. Which is the same as an hour out of game time. Okay. So then we click on that to finalize it. The barracks look fantastic. Ta-da! You should go check in with Murad. I'm going to hang out here and admire my handiwork. 